we will, we will be free for when the rising tide has turned in every London quarter. Parliament comes crashing down with Boris rules of order. Okay, Monday the 13th. Oh, God, I don't like 13th. That's unlucky. <laughs> All right, everyone. It's not Friday the 13th, it's Monday the 13th. Dun, 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 dun. And Mondays <laughs> suck, and the 13th is generally unlucky, so this is. All right, maybe you're going to miss this one. What do you think? All righty. He goes, don't hex me, woman. In I, agenda. I, okay, I, uh, I work electronics. I have hex inverters. But anyway. So we're going to get to the question. In agendas for sessions consisting of several meetings, uh -huh. most items are A, scheduled the same as the order of business for regular meetings, B, oh God, this is, never mind, I'm sorry, I get this wrong. B, general orders. C, scheduled for one meeting only. D, are postponed until the last meeting of the session. It was just as confusing to me as I can tell it is to you. Okay, try that, let's do that again. Okay, in agendas for sessions consisting of several meetings. Several meetings per session, okay, go ahead. Which would be like an LNC meeting. Or a convention. Right. Most items are scheduled the same as the order of business for regular meetings. B, general orders. C, scheduled for one meeting only. D, are postponed until the last meeting of the session. Well, sure the hell ain't D, um, <laughs> because that doesn't make any sense. Because what are you going to do with other sessions? Just, just sit around and right. sit around, do yeah. not sit around, play solitaire on your computer. I mean, yeah. And yeah. then the, your last thing of business is to adopt the agenda, agenda, and then you go home. Yeah. <laughs> well, yeah. If your agenda is just to do adjourn, <laughs> yeah. yes. it's, a, it's a nice short meeting. Um, the rest of the time you just play cards and drink beer. Uh, let's see. So it's not that one. What was A again? Scheduled the same as the order of business for regular meetings. That could be true. But not necessarily. What's B? General orders. What the hell does that even mean? <laughs> and C is scheduled for one meeting only. So I, what I think you're getting... I'm get, leaning it towards C. Because what I'm understanding C to mean, but you can understand it differently, is since it consists of several meetings, I think what they're saying is you have a different agenda for each of the meetings within the session. Possibly. But That's the way but I the way we organize conventions with multiple multiple sessions per for the entire convention. But we have a standing rule for that. So remember that you're defaulting to Roberts here, not what we uh, customarily do. Good point. In that case I may change my mind. In that case I may go with A. <laughs> wait, 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 read A again though. Okay, well you already ruled out D. Right. Okay, D's so, one. <laughs> okay, so here's the, the three And I'm kinda of, I'm kinda of getting rid of general orders, so that doesn't make any sense. Schedule. Yeah, what the hell's a general order? <laughs> A, scheduled the same as the order of business for regular meetings. Uh -huh. B, general orders. C, scheduled for one meeting only. I'm going with A then. S scheduled the same as yeah. the order of business for regular meetings? Yeah, because I don't understand what the hell general orders even means. That doesn't make sense to me. And the answer is general orders. What the, what the I I wouldn't have gotten what that right. What the bleepity bleep is a general order, and who the he and why? Why is he? Re what and how does he overrule anything? What's the reference? The, oh, okay, I'll give that to you. <laughs> but if you notice on the form agendas for um, Colorado, it does say general orders on it. It does. I, and nobody knows what it means. It does. It does. Okay. And I, I, nobody knows what it means. I looked it up once and promptly forgot. Um, Three seventy one. Okay. 23. So we're learning something here. Okay. By a single vote, a series of special orders or general orders, a mixture of both can be made. Such a series is called an agenda. No shit. When an hour is assigned to a particular subject in an agenda, that subject is generally made a special order unless by footnote of other means it is stated that the time is intended for merely for guidance, in which case the subject is only a general order. Subject for which no hours are specified in the agenda are general orders. That doesn't make any sense whatsoever. Well, it does in a way. We don't really follow this. We do on the LNC, though. This is why this makes a little more sense to me. Okay. If I say I move to postpone the secretary's report to the first thing Sunday morning, it then becomes a special order. 
no matter what business is currently pending on Sunday, I meant Sunday morning, on Sunday morning, it gets put on pause because we issued a special order mm -hmm. to specifically take up the secretary's report at that time. So anything that's not a special order or I think old business is different, but most items then, most new business is general orders. Okay. And all general order means is it's on the agenda and you don't say we're going to hear this at 2 o'clock. So then in the case of, say, one of our conventions, when everything is set A, B, C, X, Y, Z at times. They're every, general orders. Almost every, no, no, because they're set at specific times, almost everything is special orders. It doesn't say a time. For it says an amount of time allotted, but it doesn't say like a time of the day is the way uh, I understand it. It says when an hour is assigned. Yeah, we had that at the last convention. It assigned an hour? Yeah. Then it's a special order. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, then it's a special order. But, like, for instance, the board the board meeting ones where it says we're going to do X, then Y, then Z. Right. Those are general orders. Right. Because even, even though they might say we're allotting 10 minutes, right. that 10 minutes can be suspended. Or extended, yeah. Ex right. Or they may cut short because they're done, yeah. Right. So those are general orders. Okay. We don't use that terminology in the LP very much. At least no. not, well, I don't want to say that because other state parties might. We don't in Colorado. Right. And we really don't use that terminology on the LNC, though... I understand what it means. So it makes sense for me to go, why, what's a general order? Right. Because, That's why when I yeah. read that, I was like, oh, no, you're fucked. <laughs> I knew you weren't. Because that, I wouldn't expect you to because it's outside your, your, your general experience. Yeah. So, well, I'm chairing this meeting. I've got the gas. No. All right. We are. I can't bang it hard, right? He makes me be gentle. Chris, do it crisply. He makes me be gentle. <laughs> the meeting is adjourned. I'm not into I'm not into a BDSM with gavels. There's much better tools for that. Lightweight. <laughs> There's much better tools for that. Viva! Let's hear the opposition side. Like a stubborn donkey's bray, all opposed. You say nay, opposed, opposed. The motion carries anyway.